suppose it's good to see you. We well, just don't spend enough time together, Nick. When are you going to come over to my place for a barbecue? Why would the masters of evil go to Mephisto's realm? I don't know. It makes no sense. Mephisto and Doom have been enemies a long time. Why are they enemies? For years, on every Midsummer's Eve, Dr. Doom attempted to invade Mephisto's realm and retrieve his mother. Doom's mother is in Mephisto's realm? When Doom was very young, his mother made a pact with Mephisto. She promised her astral spirit turn for the power to destroy a baron who was impoverishing her people. And the deal didn't go plan. Right. She couldn't control the power and wound up killing almost everyone in her village. She died shortly after and became a prisoner of Mephisto. Was she ever freed? Yes. Oddly enough, Dr. Doom and Dr. Strange teamed up and went to Mephisto's realm. Together, they freed Cynthia Von Doom. Mm -hmm. Is this why the Tomb of Viserys was taken from Atlantis? Without a doubt. The Tomb of Viserys listed the coordinates of Mephisto's realm. With that information, Doom could properly attune Nightcrawler's teleportation portal. Hmm. Thank you, Colonel Curry. Anytime. This next mission is going to be your most difficult yet. Mephisto's realm is not a place people visit willingly. But to save Nightcrawler's life, and to find out what the Masters of Evil are doing, it is where you must go. What is Mephisto's realm? It is an alternate dimension, filled with all types of nightmarish creatures. And in this land, Mephisto reigns supreme. He watches over the astral energy of people he has duped into making deals with him. Mephisto makes deals for astral energy? Yes. For Mephisto, there is no greater joy than ensnaring a good person in a bad bargain. How do you mean? Take Ghost Rider, for instance. He was willing to exchange his astral spirit with Mephisto in return for saving his stepfather from cancer. Mephisto then allowed the stepfather to die in a motorcycle accident. Who else could we meet there? No one good, I can assure you. There is the vampire goddess Lily, and Zerothos, the entity that had been a part of Ghost Rider. But perhaps worst of all is Blackheart, the son of Mephisto. Count yourself lucky if you are able to avoid him. Thanks, Blackwater. You are quite welcome. Hi, what can I do for you? What do you know about the mutant amplifier? It was built by S.H.I.E.L.D. to analyze mutant DNA and augment whatever innate powers a mutant has. But the amplifier never got past the testing phase because of the side effects. What kind of side effects? The device was so powerful, it had a way of burning out test subjects. Any mutant that used it usually wound up in the hospital for a couple of weeks. Thanks. You know me. I'm just here to help. Who is Mephisto? Despite his appearance, he is not truly a demon. He is most likely a shapeshifter, or very skilled in casting spells that change his appearance. But he's powerful? In his own dimension, he is practically invulnerable. And he commands a great number of powerful entities such as Blackheart and Zarathos to do his bidding. There's also Lilith. Who is Blackheart? Though he is called Mephisto's son, Blackheart was created out of negative energy. This energy was generated by violent crimes that occurred in the same spot over a period of centuries. Mephisto decided such a violent creature would make an excellent protege. He took Blackheart under his wing and began to school him in the fine art of corrupting innocent souls. Who is Arathos? He is a vile creature who would consume the astral energy of his victims. His power grew to such a point that he drew Mephisto's attention. 
the two battled, and Mephisto won. So Zarathus is an unwilling servant. Yes, so much so that Mephisto sent him to Earth and bound him to different humans. Eventually, Zarathos was bound to Johnny Blaze, and thus was the birth of Ghost Rider. Thanks, Vision. Come back any time. I apologize that the Orb of Teleportation sent you to Murder World. I should have foreseen Baron Mordor's treachery. It's not your fault, Wong. Besides, that little side trip worked to our advantage. Perhaps. I find that I must ask a favor of you. Anything, Wong. Just name it. While you are in Mephisto's realm, <laughs> if you should locate the Eye of the Shadow Queen, would you bring it to me? Sure. We can do that. Will the teleportation orb work correctly now? Rest assured that the orb will now take you to the proper destination. What do you have to do to fix it? The spells required to counteract Baron Mordo's magic were quite difficult. I found it to be an intriguing test of my skills. What was the evil Clea sense near the site of storm? That was the spell Baron Mordo had cast to disrupt the orb of teleportation. It was designed to activate immediately after anyone used the orb. Oh, so that's why we teleported to Murder World rather than Doom's Castle. Correct. It is a testament to Mordo's skill that he was able to cloak the spell's true function of Clea and Doctor Strange. What is the eye of the shadow queen? It is a talisman of value to no one but me. The bauble serves as a reminder of a creature who caused me a great deal of turmoil. What did the shadow queen do? She had me abducted and taken to her dimension. It required the combined might of Doctor Strange and myself to destroy her. Thank you, Wong. It is a pleasure to be of service. Greetings. Hello, Professor Xavier. I apologize for not giving you my full attention. Using Cerebro to locate Nightcrawler requires a great deal of effort. Have you had any luck finding him? Yes, he's definitely in Mephisto's realm. I've even managed a small amount of communication with him. How is Nightcrawler? It seems the mutant amplifier is causing him a great deal of pain. Can he teleport back to our dimension? I'm afraid not. Generating a portal to Mephisto's realm has far exceeded Kurt's abilities. He's no longer able to teleport at all. Is Nightcrawler in danger? Yes. The masters of evil are intent on stranding him in Mephisto's realm once their business is concluded. But there is currently a far more pressing danger. A creature named Blackheart is stalking Kurt. Thank you, Professor Xavier. You're quite welcome. <laughs> 